Hello everyone and welcome back to the best investing podcast in the world. In today's episode, I'm going to be talking about AMD's new and secret $200 billion business that the market doesn't even know exists at the moment. The market is basically ignoring the vast potential of AMD's FPGA technology, which paves the way for an uncontested $200 billion business. This would be the second time Lisa Su decides to pursue an opportunity that the market doesn't understand. And the last time she did that, a decade Decade ago, the stock went up 25x, so let's get deep into it. Since acquiring Silinx, AMD has been positioning itself to lead what is projected to become a $200 billion plus market by the end of this decade, AI at the edge. This strategy is powered by FPGAs, Field Programmable Gate Arrays, the breakthrough technology brought in through the Silinx acquisition that enables chips to dynamically reconfigure in real time. This property promises to enable FPGAs to run neural nets more efficiently in smaller devices. Looking ahead, AI will expand beyond data centers, integrating into billions of edge devices. Running AI on these devices demands specific capabilities, namely superior energy efficiency and versatility. FPGAs excel in this regard, far surpassing other chip types and Silinx stands as the undeniable leader in this domain. The runner-up by a wide margin is Altera, which was acquired by Intel in 2015. With Intel struggling to remain competitive across the board, AMD Silinx has now blue skies ahead. As a result, the acquisition has positioned AMD far ahead of its traditional rivals, effectively making it nearly impossible for them to challenge AMD in this rapidly growing space over the next five years. AMD's FPGA division, which is actually called their embedded business segment, is set to evolve into a crucial part of the AI industry, similar to how Nvidia's GPUs dominate the data center market today. The AI at the edge market is yet to blossom, but once it does, does, AMD stands to benefit disproportionately. To understand why FPGAs are crucial to this new era of AI, we first need to explore how they work. A field programmable gate array, FPGA, is a type of integrated circuit that can be reprogrammed after manufacturing to perform a specific task. Unlike CPUs and GPUs, which are designed with a fixed architecture for general purpose or parallel computing tasks, FPGAs can be customized for specific workloads on the fly. This recon configurability makes them ideal for tasks that require optimization on the go and at the hardware level. In the context of AI, FPGAs offer a unique advantage. Neural networks which power AI models require a large number of mathematical operations to process inputs and generate outputs. These operations are computationally intense and require specialized hardware for efficient execution. FPGAs allow for the creation of custom circuits that can directly map AI operations such as matrix multiplications and convolutions directly to hardware, dramatically reducing power consumption, latency, and computational cost compared to general purpose CPUs and even GPUs. In addition, FPGAs excel in low latency environments. This is a crucial factor for AI inference especially when running on devices at the edge. Think smart cameras, drones, and autonomous vehicles, and even satellites, as I will explain in the coming few minutes, where decisions need to be made in real time. While GPUs and CPUs are fantastic for training models in large data centers, FPGAs are a much better fit for the needs of inference in small power-constrained devices. Their adaptability allows them to execute highly specialized AI functions on demand, attaining levels of efficiency that other compute engines can't possibly while NVIDIA has made significant strides in AI, particularly in data center, its GPUs are not optimized for edge computing. NVIDIA's chips are power hungry and require specialized infrastructure to deploy, which makes them less than ideal for devices like smartphones, IoT devices, and autonomous drones. On the other hand, AMD's FPGA technology is tailor-made for these environments where power efficiency and real-time processing are critical. This is not to say that NVIDIA won't be able to create similar technology in time. Time. However, Silinx's lead in the FPGA market is further compounded by AMD's chiplet platform. Silinx's FPGAs are already widely used in industries such as telecommunications, automotive, and aerospace, but their true potential lies in the rapidly growing field of AI. The combination of AMD's chiplet architecture and Silinx's FPGA technology enables AMD to create highly efficient, low power solutions that can run AI inferences at the edge with greater flexibility than NVIDIA's monolithic GPU 
new designs or than of any other competitor. Indeed, FPGAs on their own won't be particularly useful for AI at the edge applications. Rather, they need to be attached to other general purpose compute engines, and that's where AMD excels. They've been perfecting their chiplet platform for over a decade now. Although AMD has been relatively quiet regarding advancements on the embedded business segment, that's the one that englobes the Silinx operation, in Q1 2024, AMD Lisa Su shared some insightful remarks. Versatile Gen 2 adaptive SOCs are the only solution that combine multiple compute engines to handle AI pre-processing, inferencing, and post-processing on a single chip, enabling customers to rapidly add highly performant and efficient AI capabilities to a broad range of products. We were pleased to be joined at our launch by Subaru, who announced they adopted Versatile AI Edge Series Gen 2 devices to power the next generation of their EyeSight ADAS system. Some say that FPGAs won't fulfill their potential at the edge because they've been around for a while and nothing has happened yet. But Lisa's remarks demonstrate how AMD is making real progress towards the vision that I lay out in this video. AMD has the unique combination of leading FPGA technology and the capability required to integrate FPGA chips with any other compute engine at a marginal cost. Customers are already buying the products emerging from this structural advantage which makes everything that I'm talking about in this video real. This underappreciated characteristic of the AMD thesis is what makes me most bullish about the company going forward. Indeed, in 2015, the world ushered Lisa Su to get into tablets. She decided to pursue a different route, which the world didn't quite understand back then, and now the stock trades 25 times higher than when I first invested. I see the same dynamic unfolding again. In turn, AMD's strategy to blend its existing CPU and GPU products with FPGAs is part of the endless applications of AMD's highly modular platform, which the market is also disregarding at present. AMD's chiplet-based platform, which allows for unprecedented modularity and adaptability, offers lower total cost of ownership for customers while providing more tailored solutions for a variety of workloads. As AI matures, it will likely require compute workloads that we can't imagine yet, but AMD's platform will be uniquely suited to capitalize on them. This adds a great component of asymmetry to the thesis. There is no guarantee that AMD's FPGA technology will work, but the optionality of AMD's platform is vast and will likely yield novel and lucrative businesses that we can't envision today. As the rising operating leverage seen in Q4 2024 demonstrates, this platform enables AMD to take on new businesses at a marginal cost, as you can see depicted on the graph on the screen now. On the graph on the screen now, you can see how at present we have the AI at the edge business coming to take shape. On top of AMD's chiplet platform, we have inference taking off, training taking off, and AI PCs. And my point is that maybe all of these work, maybe only a few, but the rate at which AMD will be able to launch and capitalize on new huge businesses at a marginal cost will only go up over the next decade. Meanwhile, the real-world applications of AMD's FPGA-powered solutions are already coming into focus, albeit discreetly for now. In Q1 2024, AMD announced that its Versal AI Core Adaptive SOCs are now powering SpaceX's next generation satellites. This marks a significant milestone as the company's cutting edge technology plays a crucial role in one of the most innovative space ventures today. Indeed, the deal with SpaceX supports the thesis that AMD's FPGA technology is uniquely suited. Thus, while traditional analysts have focused on the competitive dynamics between AMD and Nvidia in the AI training market, they have largely and continue to do so over overlooked the massive potential of AMD's platform, particularly in inference. AMD's FPGA technology, combined with its chiplet architecture, provides a unique and scalable solution for powering AI inference at a fraction of the power consumption and cost of traditional GPUs. The inference market is poised to be one of the largest growing areas in AI over the next decade, and AMD's strategic investments in FPGA technology give it a clear path to dominate this space. With partnerships already in place with industry giants like Meta and SpaceX, AMD is well on its way to becoming the go-to provider of AI inference solutions. As the world's economy transitions into becoming an inference machine, AMD stands to reap the rewards of its vision and technological innovation. It's only a matter of time before the market realizes the true value of AMD's AI capabilities, and when that moment comes, the company's stock will likely see exponential growth. For long-term investors, my view is that the best is yet to come. But of course, this is not financial advice. These are 
merely my own thoughts and how I navigate my AMD position over time. That's it for today. Thank you very much for joining me. As always, if you enjoyed this update, can I please ask you to share this with one friend? These deep dives are for free. And so the only way this grows is with your help. Thank you very much. Take care and until next time.